Hello guys, and uh, in this video I wanted to talk about the premise of the concert pitch, which is currently set at mid lay at 440, and um, that seems to be sort of recognised across the board. I think the International um, Organisation for Standardisation kind of set 440 some time ago. Um, but it's not always the case. I mean, music, when music started, if you look at the likes of uh, Bach and Beethoven, Mozart, they all tuned their orchestras slightly differently. You know, it could be anywhere really between sort of 400 and 480. And uh, I wanted to explore this concept of, uh, of tuning to 432, which is tuning the entire logic session down by around about 31.9 cents. Um, and what that means for the pitches and what that means in terms of, you know, how your track actually sounds and how it feels. I mean, there's, there's many debate around this that have we got it right at 440? Um, one of the things that always steps out to me is when you're trying to work on a mix and uh, the bass notes in the in the sort of real lower end, you know, occasionally one will pop out more than the other. And you're always kind of thinking, well, why is that? It doesn't sort of make sense why one note would pop out more than the other. Well, if you think of how the session's tuned and how the kind of um, the fundamental, if you like, of the the entire piece um, sits and how that how that works kind of does make sense you know if you've got fundamentals and you've got nodes that keep bringing each other you know building on top of each other each kind of each kind of um section um the way it sounds and the way it, it kind of feels and the way it, it it sits with the listener the way you feel the music is going to be impacted and i think one thing that's interesting about this is if you look at even even to modern day like i think the the new york philharmonic you know they, they're tuning their their kind of um a4 if you like to or their mid lay, you know, to um, four four two, and I think I think Boston are a four four one. Um, I think four three two um, is kind of cool, and that's what this track is is written in. It's just a it's a piece I wrote that was aimed at kind of relaxation and and meditation and things like that. Um, so I wanted to kind of put this into practice. We're going to listen through to this piece twice. Um, we're going to start in four forty, and then we're going to put it down to four three two, and kind of see what we notice and and. Um, if we think it sits any better or if it sounds any different. So to do this in Logic, the, the beauty of Logic is that you can detune and uptune your session um, on a global scale. So all you've got to do is go to File, Project Settings and Tuning. And straight away, you've got this software instrument pitch, which will which will, which will will detune or uptune your entire session for you. So I'm going to I'm going to copy this 31.9, which, as we can see, there is has tuned the session to, to, to 432 hertz. Let's take that out and put that back to zero, which will put it to 440. We'll listen to the piece and then we'll we'll play it back again in in uh, in 432. And I think it's something you've got to kind of experience on your own and really actually spend just a few minutes in this video, seeing what you think um, with regards to what that sounds like, how it how it feels, how it how it sits and resonates with uh, with you. So I'm going to shut up and I'll play through in 440, which is basically our standard pitch these days. And then we'll put it back to 432 um, by detuning by 31.9 cents. And we'll see, yeah, what, what we think. And ideally, I'd like you to make your own mind up. But um, let's go for it.
So that's the piece in in 440. Um, so if we jump back into to file and we're going to go to project settings and we're going to hit tuning and we're going to put that detune in. So that's taking us down to 432. I'm going to play it again. You might need to A, B it a little bit, but I'm interested to see what you, what you feel um, in terms of how it feels for you. So that's the piece through in uh, 432. Now, to me, it sounds better in 432. It's something about the way it sits for me uh, personally. If you think that there's no difference at all, let me know. Um, um, you know, there's something maybe we can open up a conversation about. Um, but play around with it. You know, you're, you're quite free to, to change the tunings of your of your compositions as, as many times as you want. And I think it's just a new level of um, experimentation that the fact orchestras are still playing around with tunings to this day. Um, is that a reason that perhaps someone prefers a classical recording from a particular orchestra um, over a different one? Because they're playing the same piece, okay, different conductors, different players, different tempos, different different kind of um, approaches to the to the performance. But has it got something to do with the tuning that that particular um, orchestra is using as well, or band, or or um, whatever else? So, food for thought there, guys. Um, do let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time.